it's interesting to watch half the team is of course Thai and speaking in Thai and then the other half is speaking in English and, and how all of that works together and how it all fits together. <laughs> Well, they've been great, really. I can't fully understand them yet, but, you know, they're all really nice, like I said. Not only uh, Thai people and American people, you, at lunch you have Thai food and American food. So I like to go back and forth, get uh, maybe some Thai soup and some, uh, you know, part of an American dish, maybe some spaghetti or something. Have a little bit of this, a little bit of that, the best of both worlds. Very good, you guys. Beautiful movie. The crew from Thailand was incredible. They they ran when they could have walked. They worked hard when they could have uh, been indifferent. I think what, what really helped us, at least from what they've said, is that they believed in the story and its theme that we're all kings, not just some of us, but all of us. And we ought to treat each other in a, in a kingly, kindly way. I think they bought into that theme and saw its redemptive story in it. Along with that, um, I think we tried to treat everybody in the crew, and we, sometimes we, were, we were, had as many as 220. I think as a, we created a culture where everybody was treated as a king and nobody, was, there was uh, as little hierarchy as possible. Everybody played by the same rules, ate at the same tables, and were taken care of in the same way. And I think out of that culture came a lot of sacrifice of a lot of the Thai crew. So we're going up too fast. Brian came to me, uh, a name through another friend, and I sat down with Brian in, in Long Beach and we had a great conversation. I looked at a couple of his reels, they were beautiful, it was what I wanted. We sat down and talked about the palette of this movie and he caught the vision of what I wanted and I was assured, I could, I could just sense that he could deliver the kind of blacks and browns and yellows and reds and whites and, and when I knew that we both understood the vision of the story and understood the story and understood the palette of colors uh, and I knew his incredible talent I knew we'd have a great time in, and we have Brian has captured the locations and the set designs and the, and the characters in ways that I'd only hope for we we spent time in pre-production knew our camera angles knew our lenses really had thought through the story and for the last 35 days he's been a true friend brother and is an amazing talented DP, I call him my Rembrandt, and he just delivered that kind of work for me.